Hey guys, it's Jenna G and today it's all about this fish and black mushrooms and oyster sauce. It's super delicious and easy dish to put together. So I've got my fish already cut into pieces. I am using Mahi Mahi. That was caught by the husband. But if you don't have Mahi Mahi, I highly recommend any firm type of fish and just cut it into chunks. Now to this, I am going to be adding some JGM products Chinese seasoning, some soy sauce and some ground chilies. So the ground chili, depending on how spicy you want, you can adjust that. And remember, when you're using soy sauce, I'm using dark soy sauce. The salt content or sodium content in that, along with the Chinese seasoning, you want to just be mindful of those. You don't want an overly salty dish at all. So once we are ready to cook this, once everything has been mixed up and looking all nice there, we're going to be heating up our oil. You can use avocado oil in a wok. And I'm just going to be cooking the fish on each side until they're properly cooked through, depending on the thickness of the fish. It can take two to three minutes, can take more or less. So once you have them all cooked through nicely there, we're just going to remove it from our wok. I'm just going to set this aside. Now in the same wok, you can reduce your heat here. And what we're going to be doing using that same oil that we added in there, if you add, need to add a little more, go right ahead. But to this, we're going to be adding our chopped up pimentos, some grated garlic, some ginger. So we're just going to be sauteing that just for a few minutes or so. Next, what we're going to be doing is just adding our onions and we're going to be adding our mushrooms. So you're going to let this cook for one to two minutes. Let those onions cook through properly. This is black mushrooms that you find in the can. It's usually in the uh, section with the soy sauce and all those other Asian ingredients. So you're just going to cook this one to two minutes. Then in goes some sesame oil. I'm going to be adding my oyster sauce to this along with some water just a little bit. And then I'm going to be adding some of that cornstarch just to thicken it up. So adding the oyster sauce alone of course will be will have too much of an overpowering flavor. So I like to water it down just a bit. But I like to have a sort of thick sauce. So that's why the cornstarch is going in there. So you're just going to cook this for about one to two minutes until that sauce thickens up. Once it has thickened up, what we're going to be doing is just adding back our fish pieces. Now, when you add in your cornstarch, you just want to be careful. Uh, ideally, you should mix it or dissolve it into water before you add it into the sauce, just to make sure that they don't have clumps of cornstarch in there. I usually do a shortcut way, but it's all up to you. So add the fish pieces to it, mix it all up guys and yeah, believe it or not, easy, simple, delicious. That is it for your fish and black mushrooms in oyster sauce. Super easy and delicious dish to put together. I like having this of course with rice, you can have it with fried rice, you can have it make the, all the other Chinese dishes that you want. You can find those on my channel, on my Facebook page, on my website as well. So hope you guys enjoyed this fish and black mushrooms in oyster sauce sauce video and i do hope that you guys try it out soon thanks as always for watching always appreciate it i'll see you guys in my next video